Yo, listen to this. Do you hate America? No. You know, in fact, I'm knowing many inmates. I figure out we're sharing way more common. Maybe America is very much similar. Look, it's the same size. They have a, it's the same kind of this. And when you talk to them, there is nothing there even to beef about. We are naturally, you know, born not to be enemies. And whenever there's conflict, it's elites. You know, every, you know, American I met in a prison who is from rural area was very easy to deal with. He has no problem with Russia, and he was curious about Russia, despite all propaganda. They're losing their Christian values. They're losing their families. They're losing literally their countries. It's not anymore the same country. We knew America, who used to be a model for entire world, and lead and be an example, you know, like they say, a shiny town on the, you know, sparkling town on a hill. And this is, of course, pity. It was a strong country who was really a, you know, industrial might, you know, this one. And look, for 30, 40 years, deindustrialization, drug problem, crime waves. You can understand, and I feel more empathy to American after this experience than I would feel any hate. What would you consider as the most important event of the years that you have spent in prison? Uh, which events? Uh, international? Well, it doesn't matter. Maybe international. 2014. Oh, okay. Why? Well, it's, I guess, uh, would be in a history as a turning point. It's a turning point of Russia. Finally, stand up on its knees. Proud, strong. 14 years ago, when you were, if you would have known that it's going to happen with you, I mean, you're going to spend 14 years away from your family, from your motherland, would you have, uh, would you do something differently in your life? It's difficult to live on the callings of your heart. But if you listen in your heart, no, you know, yes, you're gonna, sometimes you get into trouble, but you never betrayed yourself. You know, and this inner peace give you enough strength to go through everything. Why? Because you don't have a conflict inside of you. Doesn't matter what. You have peace and tranquility because you trust in your heart. You trust in callings of your blood. You trust in, and you're never fighting who you 